Good morning, everybody. I prepared this tutorial to show you what to do if you have problems of mismatch while merging the data of your questionnaire. Indeed, I realized that although the questionnaires that you want to merge are apparently totally identic, actually, when you upload data, you might find some mismatch that, if they are not corrected, might alter your data. In many cases, you might not be aware of the mismatch, but if you see data after the merging, you realize that, that something went wrong. For instance, here I have to merge the data of the questionnaire uh, submitted in the USA and the questionnaire submitted in Ghana and the questionnaire submitted in Japan. I created a, a new questionnaire, a copy of questionnaire, with the empty format of the three questionnaires to be merged. I created the copy from the USA version. I have the empty questionnaire where I'll do the merging of the three surveys in Japan, in the USA, and in Ghana. So I start to upload data from USA, data that I have previously downloaded in the format that you know. I import my data. I start from the USA and I upload them. Okay, the first variables that I find are not important. They are variables automatically created by Qualtrics. The data of my concern starts from Q2, that is the variable of the consent, and then the following variables, Q3, gender, Q4, Q5, Q6, and so on, and the whole questionnaire. So, as you can see, this is the configure of the input, okay? So, as you can see here, I must find a full matching between here, the field of the target, the end questionnaire, and the variable that I'm going to import. So, if I find here Q2, here I must find Q2 as well, and so for every variable, okay? Q3, Q3, Q4, Q4, and so on for the whole questionnaire. In this case, the matching is perfect, also because, of course, I created this new empty questionnaire from the USA version, and here now I am importing the USA data. So, it is also logical that these data um, are totally matching uh, with the, the structure of the new uh, questionnaire uh, where I want to make the merging. Okay, so I import my responses. Here the operation is completed. I close. Of course, the operation is not immediate. Uh, it takes uh, some minutes. Uh, I have to wait a little bit to make some refreshing. Here you can see that it is starting to record the new imported data. I have still to make a little bit, refresh, until I realize that the imported data have been fully recorded, okay? You can see here I imported all data from the USA database. And so I find my data here and also here on the report. So I can start here to uh, make a first check to see if the data are all okay, okay? If the matching was all okay. And indeed here I should find, for instance, consent data as it is. I should find uh, uh, the same distribution between gender as in the original database, age, but the most important check 
can be done on the list of countries because if I am, for instance, here importing data from the USA, I should find most of the responses on the USA country. Here I should find 123 responses from the United States. Of course, in this questionnaire, where there were also people from other countries that were anyway surveyed in the United States. Okay, so this means that here in this case, uh, the merging uh, was okay and all categories uh, well matching with each other. Well, now let's go on with the merging. And now I have to import data from the GANA database. I go back to data and analysis, import data. I browse on my computer the previously downloaded data from GANA. I select them and I start the uploading. Of course, here I must make my check once again. Here there are these first variables that are not important to me because they are automatically created by Qualtrics. The variables I have to check are those from Q2, that is the variable of, a cons of consent, onward. And here I realize that there are some problems because here I see that the variable 2, that is the variable of consent, is not matching with the field 2. Here I would expect to find the field 2 that should match with the data of the variable. But it is not so because I find that my field 2 is combined here with variable 3 and field 3 is combined with variable 4. So there is something wrong and if I import my data this way I will find some uh, wrong combinations because I will find the data provided for the, third, for the field 2 in the GANA questionnaire, uh, I will find them uh, under the field of consent. And uh, uh, I will find the data for provided for age under the field of gender. So I have to correct manually this mismatch. This mismatch uh, is not apparent because the two questionnaires are apparently identical, totally identical. The, the order of the questions, uh, the number for the labels, they were apparently all identical. But probably when the, the questionnaire has been constructed, there uh, were some um, differences that uh, the questionnaire um, kept in its uh, memory. But what is important is that I have to correct them manually. So I go here because of course I cannot uh, change, I cannot modify this field. I have to modify this. I go here and I put here the corresponding field Q2 and here I find that the expected field is combined with the expected data. Of course, I have to make these changes everywhere I find a mismatch. Also here, I should put variable 3 that should match with the data provided for this variable and the same correction for all fields. Also here, in the list of country fields, I have to find responses provided for corresponding data. Here it is okay. I already find a good combination, Q6 and Q6. Here, for instance, I find that under the field yearly income, I find responses for field 7. So I have to correct it manually. Here it is okay. Here it is not okay. Okay, I have to do that manually. Also here, here, here there was a full mismatch between the two databases. Yes, here I must be very careful because here, because here I find data provided for 
the different modalities of the question 14. Okay, so this is, for instance, the uh, answers for the modality one of this question. They taste better. So here, I must find exactly the corresponding field. So question 14, and here, the modality one. They taste better, and I have to select this. Okay, here I find the responses provided for the modality two. So I go here, I select question 14, and I select the modality two. And I'll do that for every responses. Okay, three here, 14. For supporting local business here, 14, 5. Okay, it must be corresponding. Here I have to select question for 15. Here there is here it is totally messy. Okay, I have to modify almost all responses. Okay, all of them. So I did all the changes in all fields where I found mismatching. And then here, the last one, I have to put the last corresponding field for the last question, yearly income. Okay, once I am sure that all the fields and data are perfectly matching with each other. Okay, so I go back and I check that everything is okay. Of course, once again, this total matching must be found from the question of the consent onwards. What happened before is not important. I can import my responses. Once again, I need a little bit that the imported data are recorded. As you can see here, the situation now changed. And here, I can already realize that the uh, import was well done because here I already find the responses from the Ghana database. But to make my check, I need to go here to the report and here I find a situation that I guess it's the correct one. Just 10 non-consent, the other are all consent. The gender situation here, it seems to be almost perfectly balanced. The age, but let's go to the list of countries here. I expect to find the most responses on Ghana, and actually it is so, but also on the United States, because, of course, these are data that I added to the previous one. And indeed, here I find my data from the United States. So this is the correct way to go on. Okay, so... When you make your import, check that everything is totally corresponding. You have to do a check before starting the download. Then you have to make this check of total correspondence during the upload for your merging. Well, now you're ready for your merging. Good work, everybody.